Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Grumman Pilots' YouTube channel. And today we're going to be looking at a mount for the tie-down ring. Now, I went to the airport today and I forgot a tie-down ring, but this is the mount that we um, basically have been working on. Now, I'd like to give credit for this. I was watching YouTube videos one night about this mount. Um, remember the toilet bolt in it, but I don't remember the guy who did it. But I eventually re-watched enough of stuff about mounting GoPros on aircraft that I came across a guy by the name of Dentist Gibby. So I'd like to give him credit for this is his basic idea that we've modified and used some different hardware. We're not going and getting our hardware from the hardware store. We're getting all our hardware from one A Amazon, which is where this came from. But this is an AN70-4. Uh, AN washer for an aircraft. The next one is an um, yeah is an AN970-4. My bad. AN70-4. AN70-4. And here's an AN70-7. And then our good old baffle seal material cut into a basic circle. Another one. And then the other one. And then the stack is pretty much the same on the other on the other side. So what we've done is, is we've taken, this came with the um, toggle, so now we put the AN70-4, the 970-7, one piece of rubber, now the tie down mount will go right where my fingers are, then will come the other rubber, the other 970-7, the 970-4, because it'll fit because that's on a quarter inch, and then this will spin on. Now, stand by. Forgetting one of the most important parts. <laughs> Part of the reason of attaching all of this is to be able to mount a camera mount to this. Now there's a variety of ways. We're not really set on this particular one yet. We're going to be working on a couple of others. But we're just taking a look at this. And this is a copy of Dentist Gibby's, basically, by the way. Uh, this is... Um, angle iron it's three quarters of an inch wide it's um and i want to add a note uh, on this aluminum piece now i did cut it off the bar stock with a, a hacksaw and then my little pneumatic reciprocating saw uh, it was harder than i thought to do up on the workbench me being where i'm normally seated but i did get it done and then matt was nice enough to um, grind it on the grindstone as well as go behind where I can't reach quite yet. We have to move a workbench so my, the shop is more accessible for me, but Matt, a.k.a. Shop Monkey, and he does prefer Shop Monkey over his real name because he is the original. He was nice enough to get these washes and all for me to make this assembly together. Three quarters of an inch wide. It is three sixteenths thick. Uh, this piece is one inch. This is one and a quarter, and we allowed the one and a quarter for the bend to flow over into here. Uh, you just mark it, bend it on a vise with a hammer, and then we sanded it to make it nice and smooth. Uh, to keep the uh, airplane mount uh, theme going, we have an AN4-4 bolt. We have two more AN70-4 washers. It goes to the uh, mount with a quarter inch hole into the bottom of a GoPro mount. Now let's talk about the GoPro mount. This GoPro mount nut is a metric M5 mount. Now, we just got from Amazon, and thank you, John C. Edwards, for helping me procure these, that we can put all this together. And now, there is something that locks into our GoPro mount. Okay, That same mount right there that we found from Amazon, the metric M5, and the nut that goes with it, we can now put together the ones we videoed the other day. This mount will actually hold the halves together for the ball mount for the bottom where it mounts to the camera and then this goes on the tie down ring here and it's all held together with the metric m5 screw and the nut on the other side so it captures the tie down ring in that cavity so we hope you found all this useful and informative you can ignore what it said here about the breather grommet the true message is i'd like to thank all our subscribers and our viewers for watching this video so we hope you found all this useful and informative. Thanks for watching and have a good day flying your drone. Look for this link on a GPA page to support us. Thank you very much for your support.